with dessert. Some sure we left. do, yeah. yeah. Competition season's over. <laughs> <laughs> How about we get every dessert on the menu and just not get any mains? Just go straight to desserts. I'll have them all. <laughs> Sweet enough as it is. All through school, I was like wallpaper. I didn't have friends. I was very shy and introverted. And when I went to college, I went to study art and graphic design, and I found my people. All of a sudden, I was popular. Yeah. I got invited to every party, mm -hmm. and it was a completely new life for me. In general, I just got confident. And that's when I, I came out. I've been mean, ever since then. I'm flaming. <laughs> <laughs> So tell me about the weightlifting. Weightlifting. I took up weightlifting last November. Yeah. Um, to get fit and to lose weight. Right. And it is my absolute passion in my life now. I absolutely love it. Before I went to my personal trainer, I was 20 stone, two pounds. Right. I'm now 14 stone, two pounds. That's I've lost fantastic. six stone in Jesus. like nine months. That's excellent. Go so you. I just gave up junk food. I gave right. up sugar. I was eating six takeaways every night. You were eating um, six takeaways? I was nice. eating six takeaways. I was living out of the chipper, Chinese. Jesus. You know, you name right, it, okay. I, I was eating it. And then last last year, I only came out last year. Right. And it changed my whole life. I decided I'm not wasting another hour of my life. The referendum was a life changer for me. It was the most amazing thing for me that had happened. For the first time, I realised it's OK to be gay in Ireland. People are behind you. There isn't that stigma that there was 20 years ago. It's a different place. And that was kind of my wake-up call. That was when I realised, you know, Carol, you know, being true to yourself, it won't be so bad. You know, you won't be judged. People will love you for who you are. It triggered something in me then to decide at that point, this is it, I'm coming out. It's going to be the year that I'm going to do this. I've always wanted to be married and have kids, and I still do. Yeah. Um, but for some strange reason in my head, I never thought that was possible if you're gay. I thought, right. you know, I was destined to live a life with cats. So Don't knock it, I've got two cats. Got, my fur cat. babies I, are I lovely. Have a cat. I would not knock cats. <laughs> I love my cat. I've gone from a period of really not liking myself to now I love myself. <laughs> oh, girl. I'm rough. <laughs> I can save that for later. <laughs> I'll tell you now, I dress like a lady. I fucking act like a bloke, though. Of so. course, I like to hear that. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.